Okay, so what is it like being back for All Stars 3? You know, it's sort of like um, when you go back for your high school reunion, you remember all the times people put you in the lockers, uh, except this time uh, you can't keep your nose from bleeding. You cry just a little more, um, but it's so rewarding. And did you get any tips from Katya? Oh, well, she, well, she's a loser, so I can't take tips from a loser. I already know how to lose Drag Race a couple times. No, but um, Katya um, and I bonded in that we were both on Drag Race really scared. And so this time I tried to channel Katya and be a little more brave. And who do you think will be your biggest competition? I think the biggest competition here is the ultimate postmodern pimpo, Shangela. Because Shangela and I have both taken our 15 minutes on Drag Race and stretched it like Taffy pulled it into careers. And if anybody can make something like All Stars into a winning experience, it's Shangela. She's amazing. And was there anyone you were shocked to see come back for All Stars 3? Kennedy's still alive. Oh my God. That's fierce. You know what? She deserves one more, like, you know, make a wish foundation, put on foundation drag experience. What do you think RuPaul thought of all your impressions of her? I think RuPaul finds my impressions, uh, <laughs> I don't think she sees it. What's funny is, have you ever done someone so fiercely that they're like, I don't see it. And you're like, really? Because everyone sees it. But one time I also told RuPaul that she was scary and she was like, no, I'm not. Everyone says that. Then you are, Linda. You are scary. Do you know what I mean? So I don't think she thinks I'm like her, but I, I think I do a good RuPaul.